Hello, you massive Burger Kings. And guess who's back? Yes, it is me, Judd. And that VK tried to need my sniper. But yes, I am back from the Spania. Spania? Yes, that's the one. It was a very nice holiday. And today, I think I'm... Well, actually, I think the aim of the game for this commentary was to mainly just talk about my last... Some of my thoughts, well, my some of my last thoughts on Halo 4 and about my holiday. I guess you guys don't really care, but I will. Yeah, um, I'll just say a little bit about the uh, game first. I started this game off with a lovely devil gear, my two pro nades, as you saw. But yeah, uh, basically this, this gameplay isn't all that great, but I get a couple of sprees with a snipe. I, I know it's not amazing, but oh well, guys. I, I got this literally a day or two before I left. I just needed something to speak over. But yeah, uh, that's about it for the gameplay. I don't know why I go. Uh, oh well. It was a very close game. But anyway, yes. Spain. Spain was nice. Very hot. I got burned quite a bit. My light. The minute I think I've got a massive blister on my knee, it fucking hurts so much. Uh, played, played lots of ping pong. Um, I didn't beat anyone at ping pong. Well, I beat a couple of people because I went, I went to town on their asses. Because I'm a ginger kid, try hard, noob, slaying, but kiss. Yeah. Also. I played a lot of pool actually, and I'm actually quite good at pool, so I I beat loads of people at pool. I nearly made a little kid cry as well, which I feel bad about, but you know, I won, so oh well. Oh well, so I did a lot of swimming, getting sunburn, and ping pong. And I went clubbing. Clubbing's amazing. Clubbing is fun, especially when you're out until like 6 in the morning. And then we met lots of girls. Guys, you know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about those girls. Those girls, yeah. Yeah, met about 11. But you know, because I'm, I'm a loyal man. I'll stay to my word. Well, it's stick to my word, by the way, yeah. Because of my girlfriend, I didn't do anything. Because I'm not an asshole. Mr. Quas. That's horrible. But still, just casually rape him in the bum hole. Oh, yeah, clubbing's good. So when you're old enough, I'm not even old enough, but it's Spain, so they don't really care. So if you're like, if you listen to this now, and you're like 16, 17, make sure you dress properly, have a decent hairstyle. Yeah, and they will not take you for like a 12 year old. You gotta act like an adult as well. Oh, luckily, they didn't pick up on my random shit I normally put out. But yeah, clubbing was nice. I was fucking for the last week. I was most probably drunk out 24, 24/7, pretty much. I I missed, not missed. I was like. I think out of the seven days in the week last yeah last week I was drunk for about five of them two of them were rest days I'm not adding to it but I was pretty pretty stupid but it was still fun I uh, I went clubbing and I had an early flight so I was pretty tired for that and wasn't a good idea but I still had fun Ah, yeah. Spain was nice. I think the hottest day was like 40, 41, 42 degrees. Which was, was fantastic. I very much enjoyed that holiday. I wish I was still there. Because fucking England, I mean, it's horrible. It's disgusting and all raining and shit. I don't like it. Too cold. I'm a ginger kid and I still want heat. <laughs> 
But yeah, I guess I'll move on to my last. Actually, no. Not my overall four. I can change it for this one. Uh, I saw today. Oh, I missed the 360 triple. Oh, yeah. Moving on. Um, I saw today that uh, the Forge World, Forge World gameplay has been put out and new assassinations such as the Oddball and the Flag one. The Flag one. Oh my god, that's sick. You fucking stab him through the face. Who doesn't want to be able to stab a flag through someone's face? That's amazing. And the Oddball one. The Oddball one was just a fucking setup and a half. Like, in a good way. Like, he threw it to him and he just, like, uppercutted him. And he turned into dust. And with Forge World, it's it's looking a lot like Reach. But I think with the dynamics and the way they've done all the graphics and stuff, they sort it out proper good. So there'll be, like, shade and stuff to, like, you know, like... Like, you, I can't really say it, but on the bases on hemorrhage where there's no like shade there's actually shade in the little bases on reach which is actually really cool it none of the stuff looks like plain so it's all good what else have I seen uh, I've seen a couple new armors I'm pretty much sure they're gonna be well cool and I still need to pre-order my, my limited edition copy. And I really need to get that. Because I don't think I can go long without pre-ordering Halo 4. I think that um, it's going to be a really good game. I've seen the li also the limited edition Xbox Slim. Halo 4 Xbox Slim is, looks amazing. The uh, controllers are very very shiny and they have a nice design on them oh uh what else is there i don't think there's actually oh, anything else for halo for like updates oh i nearly got ninja oh get face palmed yeah it's coming up to the end of the game guys so i'm just gonna go uh miss a no scope on my own teammate and uh look across the map line it up and no yeah, there we go, guys. There's the end of the game. Hope you've enjoyed. Goodbye.